Coward Punch victim Danny Hodgson is tonight pleading for an end to senseless violence on our streets. The 26-year-old is pushing for harsher penalties, breaking his silence on the sickening attack that left him in a coma. A single encounter changed Danny Hodgson's life forever. But eight months on, he's already doing things doctors said he never would again. Every day is a challenge. The main thing now is to, to learn how to walk again. Um, which I've, I'm improving rapidly. It's amazing. It's um, something we didn't think we were going to see. We were told he wouldn't do it. And here he is just knocking down barriers and making me proud every day. This sickening one-punch attack, unprovoked, unpredictable and utterly inexcusable, landing the 26-year-old soccer star in a coma with a catastrophic brain injury. His teenage attacker slapped with a sentence of just three and a half years. The crime needs to match the time and at the moment it's just not. This unprovoked attack broke our family, literally broke it to pieces. We're literally putting our pieces of our lives back together every day and it's never going to be normal. The Hodgson family says today's announcement of a million-dollar federal government boost for Danny Green's Stop the Coward Punch campaign is a start, but isn't enough, calling for a mandatory minimum sentence of 10 years. If they want to stop this happening, they've got to, they've got to act now. And the quicker they act, the quicker it stops. <laughs> Our party precincts have been turning ugly for years, authorities passing the buck back and forth. And I feel as though you're just throwing money after money and nothing's going to change. A bitter pill to swallow for his parents, who flew to Perth last September to be by their son's side and haven't left. 186 days in hospital, the Joondalup player says he wouldn't be where he is without them. There's always light at the end of the tunnel. you just got to... Brace yourself and just set your mindset that you're going to get through it and happy your days will come. Jerry DeMassey, Nine News.